Hello everybody, how are you? Today we'll complete our two questions about algebra from Marcel book. Look at it with me about this question. If x minus 2 is one of the factors of determined, x minus 1, negative 3, x plus 3, x plus 3, x plus 5, 2, 2, negative 6, x plus k, then k equal. Okay, we can find the result here if x minus 2 is a factor, if x minus 2 equals 0. So x will be equal to, okay, we must write 2 here, cancel x and write 2 of all term here. Understood? He give us this information, x minus 2 is a factor, then x minus 2 will be equal 0, so x will be equal to. Then we must write here 2, 2 minus 1 equal 1, negative 3, 2 plus 3 equal 5, 2 plus 3, 5, uh, 2 plus 5, 7, all right, 2, 2, negative 6, 14 plus 30 equal 44, negative 150 and negative 170, we can write negative here and 8 them, write 0, 7 plus 5 equal 12, 2 under care up to, it will be equal 0. Then we can complete 22k equal it will be positive 220 subtract by 44 and then subtract 27 it will be 10 minus 4 equals 6 and 11 minus 4 equals 7 and rate 1 and then we can divide it by 22 the result will be equal 8 Okay, choose letter B. Next question here is a blend equation which bisects the line segment joint to points P and C of the following equation equal. We must find the midpoint between B and C. Midpoint x1 plus x2 divided by 2, 2 plus x equal 8. 8 divided by 2, 3 plus 7 divided by 2, 4 plus 8 divided by 2. The result will be here 4 and 5 and 6. It's the midpoint. Okay, put this point on all straight line here. Let x equal 4 and y equal 5 and z equal 6. In all equation here, we know 4 plus 5 plus 6 equal what? 4 plus 5, 9, 9 plus 6 equal 15, 15 minus 15 equals 0. So this point lies on this plane. Choose the letter C. Look at here in the expansion x power 2 plus 1 over x to the power 18. The ratio between the term free of x of the coefficient of the middle term equals space. You want to find the ratio between term free of x and the coefficient of the middle term. Okay, look at here. First, I will write uh, the general term here, t, r plus 1. It will be, right, see here, and we have here power 18, right, 18 up here and down here, r. We can write multiplication the second term, 1 over x power down here, and the first x bar to power the difference between them 18 minus r okay it's a general term he give us this information free of x we can sample it 18 tr duplication x power negative r duplication x power 36 minus 2 r and you can write 18 cr multiplication by x power 36 minus 3r this is a general term here give us information free of x we want to find which term free of x we must write this power equal 0 let 36 subtract 3r equal 0 then r will be equal 12 r equal what 12 then the term will be 13 it's there 
having all three of x as the coefficient of middle, we must know the middle. Such that middle will be equal what we know here, power 18. 18 plus 1 equal what? 18 plus 1 equal 19. Then 19, we can must we can here it 1 and divided by 2, it will be 10. Since then, the middle term, it will be 10. So, you want to find the ratio between term 13, 13 of term, and the middle term of term. Understood? You want to find what? The ratio between the term 3 of x, term 13, and the coefficient of the middle term, middle term 10, 10. Right power here. Right, coefficient, he asked about what? Coefficient, okay, put x equal, cancel x in any example. So we can write 18c12 over 18c here will be 9. Because term 13 equal 18c12 and term 10 equal 18c9. And then we can find the result by using calculator. It will be 21 over 55 understood first we must know which or which term free of x which term free of x term 13 which term is the middle term 10 we must find the ratio between coefficient of them coefficient it's meaning you put x equal 1 cancel x so gen general term here 18 c what huh? c12 over 18 c9 because to a term 13 here we must cancel one from 13 and cancel one from 10 equal 9 the result will be 21 over 55. the number of ways of distributed distributed three smaller or three similar similar poles in four boxes okay he tell us similar we can repeating okay we can repeating here and we have into order so we must using the rule in plus r n plus r subtract by 1 c r in here was four boxes plus r 3 subtract by 1 c 3 4 plus 3 7 7 plus 1 minus 1 equals 6 6 3 3 shows that are c because all balls are similar and he will put the poles without order without order it's meaning n plus r subtract by one in reverse to boxes number of boxes and r reverse to poles poles subtract by one c competition by r r here reverse to poles how many poles three the result will be c six c three if you want to find the result you can use a calculator or we can write here 6 multiplication by 5 multiplication by 4 over 3 times 2 times 1 the result will be equal 20 or letter C